What's bracking guys? In this player growth test, I'll be taking like a Tony Watts, the 21 year old striker, starts at a 69 overall, really has some good base stats, uh, you know, with training you can improve his agility, finishing, uh, ball control, dribbling, he's already pretty set with strength and pace in my opinion, uh, we'll take a look at his player information though, um, before we really get into things, 6 foot, uh, striker right footed, medium low work rates, um, and his 3 star weak foot, 3 star skooma, so that's pretty solid, and again you can see he's pretty pacey, has good balance, strength, of course ball control, dribbling and agility finishing all areas you can improve yourself so uh that's some really good really promising so i mean you can honestly just train him uh kind of over train him even if you if you want uh because he will certainly grow pretty nicely uh over the years here 80 overall in your 2020 age 26 um he's improved a bit of the pace strength agility jumping i mean really all over the place secondly a lot stronger ball control dribbling finishing long shot shot power heading accuracy curve penalties all look very good there some decent attack vision as well so again i i do think you know you might as well just go right into it you know train him once you're able to get a hold of him and you can get him up there close to his uh potential but uh really strong in the air uh, I got pretty unlucky with some of these headers. Uh, there was some great goalkeeping, but uh, you know he's very good in the air, good frame, uh, decent physical stats. So pretty nice to get him in those spots. And he, once he you know grew with his agility, especially he was even more deadly because he has that pace and strength. Great combination go along with that six foot height, and he can really take a rip at uh, at it like he did there. You can see him now cutting back in, holding off the defender, slides that one in the back of the net. Some good work from him. He saw a bit of that agility and strength in that highlight. And is finishing as well uh, you can see it again here the way he was cut he cuts back in with the defender on his back gets the shot off and ends up grabbing a goal there so you can see him again you know so close on the headers this time hitting the crossbar he's basically isolated on that player um, and was able to win the header so it was good to see him uh, in those one-on-v-one -on -one situations be able to win the headers did win those flick on headers at times as well you can see again very good in those tight spaces holding off defender puts in a great shot that was only saved due to an, a tremendous save uh, you can take a look at it again uh, you know a, a defender on his back takes the shot big save from the keeper uh you know he's a lot of fun to use he's great in the build-up play as you can see here uh, ends up getting the assist just a quick turn quick pass gets the assist um you know just perfect in the build-up play really in my opinion was a complete forward uh and you could see it definitely in these highlights uh you can see him now some great inner plays that would put this on the back of the net after good build-up play that will just about round out the highlights now you can see he would cap out at an 82 overall at age 29 did unfortunately you know so you can see dropped a little bit in those physical stats so uh this was when he was at his peak both physically and technically just tremendous player you can see um great pace strength you know you can certainly get that agility up to your liking as well along with the ball control dribbling finishing uh in those other areas so i certainly do recommend taking a look at him he was a lot of fun to use really a complete forward again in my opinion so with that though so thanks for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll catch you guys later.